Experiment 8 Study of Stomata The aim of the experiment is to prepare a temporary mount of leaf peel to show its stomata. The materials and apparatus required to perform this experiment are a die cut leaf, watch glass, glass slide, cover slip, forcep, needle, brush, safranin, glycerine, distilled water, blotting paper and a compound microscope. Before we start with the experiment, let us revise some theory related to this experiment. Stomata are small apertures found widely scattered on the epidermis of leaves and young stems. They are mostly found on the lower surface of a dicot leaf and on the lower and upper surface of a monocot leaf. Stomata gets widely opened after exposing to sunlight and found to be closed in darkness. Stomata regulate the exchange of gases and water vapor between the atmosphere and leaves. Let us now begin with the experiment. Take a die cut leaf and tear it. Get a thin peel using forceps. Keep the peel in a watch glass containing water. Put few drops of safranin stain in the watch glass. After 2-3 minutes, take out the peel using a brush and place it on a clean glass slide. Now, put a drop of glycerine over the peel and place a clean cover slip gently over it with the help of a needle. Remove the excess of stain and glycerine with the help of blotting paper. This is a temporary mount of a dicot leaf. Observe this temporary mount first under the low power and then high power magnification of a compound microscope. Observations The epidermal cells are visible. These are irregular shaped cells and have no intercellular spaces. Many small pores called stomata are seen scattered among the epidermal cells. Each stomata is guarded by two kidney-shaped guard cells, each containing chloroplasts and a nucleus. Conclusion Thus, after observing the temporary mount of leaf peel under the compound microscope, we can conclude that tiny pores called stomata are present on the surface of the leaves. Come, let us now discuss some precautions to be taken while performing this experiment. Always use clean and dry glass slide and cover slip for mounting. To get accurate observations, folding of the leaf peel should be avoided. While staining the leaf peel, Add appropriate amount of safranin to prevent overstaining or understaining. Cover slip should be put carefully over the stained specimen avoiding any air bubbles.